we had some interesting anecdotes <laughs> with um, the thing was always difficult to start. Um, the, it's hard explaining to people who use a special fluid, it was known as IPN, isopropyl nitrate, which had a stench of sulphur when it was fired off. Uh, that powered the starter motor and it was a mono fuel that needed air to ignite but didn't need air to burn. Um, that was probably the biggest joke around, making sure the, all the lines were connected up correctly. Uh, in those days, I'm not sure if it's still fitted, but in those days we used to have a container of diesel connected to a pipe that we pumped into the exhaust to get the, the white smoke. In other words, we were polluting the atmosphere with diesel. <laughs> and yeah, we, it was, for us it was treated as another military aircraft. Um, you know, I remember certain jobs that were horrendously difficult. The, gun, the A4 gun site, I think it's A4 gun site. The getting the oxygen bottles in and out. Um, I remember my troop dropped the, uh, the knob off the clock. And in those days, close enough was not good enough. And so we had to strip out the entire cockpit, including the ejection seat. The whole lot was removed to find the knob off the clock. And we did find the knob off the clock and we found a pile of other rubbish that was down there as well, which was quite, was, was a bit of a laugh in those days. Um, I do have photographs of people climbing down the intake because the Avon engine, uh, you had, we had a larger intake and had a dip in it. So you used to watch some piece disappear into the dip. Uh, yeah, that was the only saving grace of being at 2AD.